In this video, I'll show you how to change the domain on a WordPress blog. A lot of people use free internet service providers to host their blog. Uh, one example is biotoast.com. And every once in a while, they will change the free domains that they allow you to, to use. So a good example is this morning when I received an email saying that the blogs hosted on subdomains under isgreat.org have now all been changed to is-great.org, a new domain. So if you come to your blog, this is what it will look like, your WordPress blog. The quickest way to fix this is by making one configuration change to your WordPress installation. Log into your ISP FTP server with your usual username and password. Navigate to the directory where you have installed WordPress. And in that folder, you'll find a file named wp-config.php. Go ahead and download that. And open it in any text editor. We're going to add two lines at the beginning of that file. Save the file and close it and upload it again to your ISP come back to your browser refresh the page and that should fix the basic settings for your WordPress blog now there's one thing that this won't fix which is WordPress is typically configured to use absolute image URLs for any images that you have on your blog so if you use this method you'll have to manually change uh, all those image URLs by editing the posts. The second way to change this is a little riskier but it's also more thorough. Log into your control panel at panel.biotos.com and click on PHP My Admin under the database management section. Select the database where you have your WordPress installation And first, we're going to back up our existing database. Click on the Export tab. And you don't need to change anything here. Just click Go. This will give you a file uh, that's downloaded that ends with .sql. Open that file to make sure that you have a good backup of your database. This is the last time that you'll have a complete backup of your database before changing things. And, uh, you know, you'll see a bunch of SQL database statements in it. Everything looks good here. Keep the original file and make a copy of it. And then edit that copy. In my case, I'm looking for everything that has a string isgrade.org in it and I'm going to change it to is-great.org. You can do this in any text editor. Just click Replace All. And there should be a, a number of occurrences of that. Save the file. Close it. Go back to PHP My Admin. Now we're going to delete the existing WordPress database, click on Check All, and select Drop. Confirm that you're actually going to drop all the tables in your database. Look for the confirmation statement. Then we're going to click on Import. Now we're going to select the file that we made all the changes to. Click Go. Look for the confirmation statement. And that should do the trick. Now you can go back to your blog, refresh, and everything, including all the image URLs, should be changed now.